What's going on, guys? All right. I had to record this match. Uh, it's me versus uh, Saltface. And uh, yeah, man, it was like it's hype. It's hype. I mean, if I remember right, it was hype. I don't really. Okay, this, this is my first time watching it since I recorded it. So, wait a minute, let me be quiet for a second. Where am I on that scale of yours? At best, a fourth level intellect. Begin. <laughs> I love that. It's so funny. Anyway, this is my first time watching it after I played it. It's probably like a week ago, I want to say. Anyway, it was really good games. Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at this Brainiac. Mmm. Mmm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. I tried to uh, do a little floaty thing. I ain't gonna lie, man. This this matchup is it can be hard for Brainiac, really hard. You are not worth collecting. Like it's a guy named uh, the Wayne Number One, and his Harley Quinn is like. Jeez, uh. you cannot kill me. He beat me like seven to ten, I think. When I first played him. Now I I might win if we play it again because I kinda understand the matchup a lot better. Again, again. The thing about Brainiac though, like he's a good character, it's just he he needs like, well, I don't like to say he needs, but I would like for him to have better staggers, less recovery on, get your escape, less recovery on, you know, like, oh my gosh, look at those air escapes. I try to air escape and it never works. It never works. Holly Quinn gimmick. But yeah, if he had like less recovery on his strings, like one one three. Just just give him less recovery on that string. I'd be I'd be good to go. Cause after I do that string, I'm like negative three, but I still can't I still can't move. If I try to move I get humbled, combo punished. I have to block after doing that string. It's like one of his safety strings. I just canceled it to a bounce cancel just to end it. I didn't want to do with any more bounce cancel. I mean, any uh, air escapes or, you know, clashes or anything. I just wanted to end it. So it's, really, it's always good to get that first game, especially off of someone that's like really good, like Saltface. Because it boosts your confidence. So if you get that first game is very important. Very important, and it gives you the counter picking advantage. If you're a counter picker, I'm not. I don't really counter pick. I rather just play bring it. if you get over okay that was good only if you get under the cupcakes can you punish like that now in the corner brainiac is like he's a god in the corner so he can loop his that pick trait and all that good stuff good block salt face honestly I wouldn't know what to do either in that situation <laughs> I had to break there best is not enough I had to break I think I'm gonna use one bar yeah I did yeah that's the best thing to do in, in my mind take less damage okay 
saying. I got lucky. Ain't gonna lie, I got lucky. Because if he would confirm that to a combo, that would have been it. And that might be it. it. Yep, I think. Yep, yep, yep. No, no, no. Yes, no. Ah. 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 Well, you know, nothing wrong with believing. So it's 1 1. I actually don't think he came off of Harley Quinn this whole set. I think he stayed on her the entire time, which is good. Because, you know, that's that's the honorable thing to do. I'm not like trying to counterfeit me with like Wonder Woman. I think. But it was funny though, because I went to his, uh, his Twitch stream. I didn't know he was streaming until after the matches. But I went to him and I was like, good game, Sawface. He's like, yeah, man, you lucky. You lucky I didn't counterpick you with Wonder Woman. I'm like, uh, okay. <laughs> and I fought good Wonder Women before. Like, Acromaniac, really good Wonder Woman. Annoying! I mean, the character's annoying. But, he's really good. He's really good with her. Uh, Katana Prime, I played him before. Twice. He's really good too. Uh, Mr. J69, he's, they're all, all three of them are like great Wonder Woman player and it's, players and it's like really hard to fight. I don't know if it's like Brainiac who just struggles or it's just me. <laughs> but either way, that character's good. Personally, I liked her old design, but you know. NRS gets to control how a character so plays. It's their game. They want to make Wonder Woman play like a turtle. That's their decision. Defensive turtle. Now I don't know why he blocked like it was a cross up right there. But it seems like that happens a lot. Like a lot of people do. They, they think it's a cross up in that exact sequence. I don't understand why. I do it a lot, and every time I do it, they block wrong, as if I'm about to cross them up, which I'm not. That was a punish, and he's still air escaping. It's crazy. I was trying to like make him scared of the lows right there. That's why I was poking. Like, down one, down one, down one, down one, down one. Cause like first Brainiac, all you see is people just you know. But that was a good punish. All you see is people just. Blocking high because they scared of dive kick, you know, which you're supposed to be because dive kick can lead them to like 400 damage. I mean, just one bar, two bars, like 450, depending on which character you are. If it's dark side, you might lose 500, 600. I don't really know to be honest, but um, so the score is 2 1 now. I'm up. And it's looking pretty good. Oh, okay. Now he's just shooting to death. He said, he said, no, you ain't about to beat me. <laughs> nope. Look at these guns. Look at these bullets. Okay, good, good. That was good confirmed. I confirmed that. Oh my gosh, how did you block? How? How did you block that? Can somebody explain? What is this combo? Jesus. How did he block? Somebody please tell me. That's like unblockable and you blocked it. It's like a sliding cross up. <laughs> That's the best way to explain it. How do you block a sliding cross up? I can't lie, man. When I first started playing with Brainiac, I was like, this dude, this dude suck. It's like, what? Why did they make a boss character? It will be Who doesn't play effect. like a boss? But he is actually pretty godlike. If you play with him the right way, I guess. Not really the right way, but the way I play with him, I think it's pretty godlike. 
I'm not trying to like brag or nothing. I'm just saying like, look at this, look at this. Ooh. He blocking high, boy. He know, he knows. Punish, punish. There you go. Oh, that combo was ugly. Who's that? Woohoo! Oh my gosh. I dropped that. Like, it's, it's such a tight, a tight combo. It's really tight. You gotta time it correctly to get it. But if you do get it, it's a good payoff. You can get like 400 off that. But you gotta use a bar meter for the tentacle strike at the end. If that's what it's called. I don't know. Like, tendril thrash. See, right here, he was just running for me. And I kept catching them on this back dash. But good games. Good games off face. Man, that was really good stuff. But yeah. Keep a lookout, man. I'll be posting more videos in the future. Um, kind of busy with school and everything. College, blah, 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 blah. But now that I know how to do voiceovers and record my voice and do these voiceovers like this, yeah, you'll be hearing a lot more from me and seeing a lot more of my videos. Thanks, guys, for watching, and uh, I'll be seeing you soon. And thank you, all nine of my subscribers, or ten of my subscribers. You guys are awesome. Beautiful.